Hi everyone, my name is David and today we'll be talking about Testand. Testand is NI's test executive software for accelerating the development and deployment of test systems for engineers in validation and production. Testand automates, accelerates, and standardizes the overall test process across all of your testers with native functionality for creating, executing, and debugging test sequences. With Testand, it can be as simple as drag and drop. Additionally, with Testand, you're able to reuse test code developed in LabVIEW, Python, C, C++, or .NET. With Testand, you're never starting from scratch and can use what you already have. Testand comes with built-in built -in, uh, report generation, and you're able to store results to local or network databases, which is key when you need to uh, record keep or review information in the future. With Testand, you're also able to deploy test sequences built to all of your testers with pre-built or custom operator interfaces. This is key for streamlining tests in your validation lab or production floor. Let's go ahead and open up Testand. Here I have opened the testing development environment. In the center, I have our steps pane. And I already have opened a mobile device test demo. Here I have three test steps already written. But if I was looking to add to this test in any way, I would go ahead and open up our insertion palette. Here at the top of our insertion palette, we have our testing adapters. This allows me to call test code written in LabVIEW, Python, C, or .NET. If I was looking to incorporate any form of decision-making functionality into our test, I would open up our flow control section. For example, if I wanted to skip a few test steps after the power on test failed, I could go ahead and drop in an if statement. Additionally, with our database connections, I'm able to fetch parameters or configurations as test is executing. As I mentioned, testing also includes report generation and I'm able to generate reports in standard formats like XML, HTML, et cetera. I can also generate them in PDF formats, and for longer running tests, I can configure on-the-fly reporting so results are logged as test is executing. Here, I'm also able to configure it to store in local or network databases. In Testand, I'm able to run the test right here to preview what an operator would interface. Or as I mentioned, I can deploy, when I deploy this, I can include standard operator interfaces. So let's go ahead and open one up and run this test. Here I have the same mobile device test demo with a few additional test steps. This is a simulated test, by the way. So when I hit run, I'll be prompted to see if anything wants to fail. I'm going to ahead and hit no. I want this test to pass. And here we have our reports. I'm able to scroll and see each test step pass. Let's talk a little bit more about Testand now. Testand comes with all the features that we just explored. However, not every feature is relevant to a test team at every given time. And you may not want to develop a feature that you don't need in the moment. However, due to unforeseen circumstances, like an increase in devices that number increase in the number of devices that need to be tested, you either need to purchase additional testers or build in parallel execution. This can occur for a number of other features that you may need and don't see at the beginning, like operator interfaces, uh, unit tracking, etc. And as we can see, due to the time it takes to develop all of these features, we may not want to develop it if we don't need it in our in that moment. However, the problem is when you do need that feature, you often don't have the time to develop it. I've spoken to a number of engineers about the challenges that they face in their test process. And this usually is in four main categories. The first is time. Time is always a pressure for test engineers. This can come about through changing requirements, compressed timelines and wanting to bring products to market faster, et cetera. With Testand, you can make sure that you can adapt effectively and efficiently to changing requirements to meet your, those time constraints. The second is cost of ownership. As we just mentioned, as we continuously need to add features to our test executive, we're adding to the overall cost of ownership with time spent developing these new features uh, in a bit-by-bit -bit fashion. 
Testing, Testan can mitigate some of this by making sure we have all the foundational features of a test executive from the start. You don't need to add to it each time to develop new features. The third is productivity. This can come about in two ways. The first is test station productivity. This can be a challenge in making sure that your test station is testing as many devices as possible. Testing can help with this as it includes built-in parallel execution functionality so you can increase throughput and test all your devices efficiently. The second productivity challenge is engineering productivity. As test engineers spend more time developing test features, um, they waste time that they could be spending elsewhere, like focusing on designing tests for the products. Testing can mitigate some of this. As I mentioned, it has every feature that you need to test your device. And the fourth is lifecycle management. This can become an organizational and expensive challenge as you manage numerous disconnected test systems. As new team members get onboarded, they need to learn the ins and outs of each test system. And if product documentation is lacking, they may not be able to understand the test executive that's already been built, which many times can cause engineers to rebuild the same test executive over and over and over again. With test and, this can be mitigated by making sure that you have all the features that you need from the start. You don't have to rebuild the same features or test executives. It's already complete. Additionally, this comes with product documentation, training, getting started courses, etc. And I make sure that each version is backwards compatible and can run on the latest operating system. For, for purchasing Testan, there are a number of licensing options. The first is the Testan development system. This is where you'll create your test sequence. When looking to scale and deploy your test system to multiple test stations, there's the base deployment engine, which includes simple debugging tools, or the debug and deployment environment, which includes advanced debugging tools for troubleshooting. Additionally, you're able to purchase Test and Development System as a part of Test Workflow Pro. This includes many of our NI test software, such as LabVIEW, Diadem, FlexLogger, GWeb development software, and more. For getting started with Testan, go ahead and get a free trial, learn more on NI.com, or reach out to your NI representative for more information. Thank you.